Hey everybody, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to add a signature on Office 2013 for Mac. The interfaces can look pretty different sometimes when comparing to Outlook 2013 on a PC. So here I'm going to show you how it's done on a Macintosh computer. So we'll start in Outlook over here and I'm going to click here at the top left and select Preferences. From here I'll select Signatures and here's my home base for all things signatures. I can list all the different signatures I want here. And down here, I can choose which signatures I want to use by default. So depending if I have multiple accounts in one Outlook Center, I can select that here. I can select a default signature for any new message going out. And I can select a default signature for replies or forwards. Let's say I wanted to add a new signature today that has an image. I'm going to copy paste this signature here that includes an image and paste it into my signature box. We'll copy that. Now when I want to add a new signature, I'll click the add button and I'm going to paste my new signature here. As you can see, the image carried over and as did the rest of the information I needed. Sometimes images can be tricky, but if you copy paste, this is how that would work. I'm going to title the signature and it'll automatically save. Now to show you how it works in a new message, let's create a new message. So you have the option to choose from your signature from this drop down menu here. I'll click into the body of my message and from the drop down I have the three signatures we just saw. Standard, Ninja, and Better Cloud. Let's select the new one. And as you can see it appears right there. Now remember we did have the option in our settings to have a default signature available. But if you switch between signatures often this drop down will be helpful for you. If you use the same signature each time then you can select a default signature. Thanks for joining us today for this quick tip. Hope you found it helpful, and we'll see you next time.